<laughs> we are gagging right now. We are dead. Hey. hey. Yes, we love you. Oh my gosh. Since motherfucking 2008, when I was in eighth grade and I could listen to rap music mm-hmm. on my own. Thank you. I appreciate it so much. We and congratulations on, on you doing your thing and rapping and, and writing and going to school. Okay. Exactly. You know I've always been about school. Like yes. when when it wasn't when it wasn't popular to talk about it. I always thought that that was a dope thing. So Apparently I, motherfuckers are still confused about bitches going to school. Like it's not the real, not the real motherfuckers. Not the, not right the real motherfuckers. You know, you know what I'm saying? But people, you know, they're a little scared of it. They're a little shook. About you being in school? This motherfucker's gonna ask me, sorry, are you not ashamed about planning being in college? My only regret in life is not going to college. That's my only whole regret in life. Like, I just wanted to go to college just to say, like, I didn't have that experience. And, like, I always feel like... When I see people go to college, like I'm living vicariously through them. College hard as fuck. So I mean, and but we just drop out. <laughs> <laughs> I looked at that check. I said, "Damn, we gonna finish school though." <laughs> no, no. Oh hell to the motherfucking no. We gonna finish. Better, you finish school. You better finish school. I'm going to finish that shit. I, I just started doing like a scholarship pageant for other girls that like to get turned and still go to school. Really? What year are you in? I'm a senior. I'm about to graduate. You're a, oh, you definitely going to finish school then. What's your oh, major? yeah, I'm going to finish that shit. What's your major? Healthcare administration. Ah. Yeah, nothing to do with music. I just wanted to open up some like facilities in my city. That's so dope. Living facilities in the city, you know. For you can, and, and, you, and you can still do that. You should still do that. We gonna do that. Yes, you have to do that because th- sometimes people have like two different kind of callings in their life, you know. So make sure you do that too. That too. That's Very a, much that's that. Because that's a blessing in itself. You know what I'm saying? That comes back, and you just. I, it, everything is happening simultaneously, I think, because you're in school, it's your senior year, yes. and, like, you're doing your thing in, in the music, and now it's, like, all coming together, which is, a, like, the best feeling in the world. You don't want to be... Because then... Cause two then, plan A's. Huh? I had two plan A's, school and music. That's good. I had, um... My plan A was acting... To be honest, and I know because we it. know. Look, like I did slumber party. Yeah, I didn't make it, and um, and then I said, you know, let me try music. Baby, you was Nicki Minaj. How you gonna do a freaky girl song without Nicki Minaj? Okay, like. And you wanna know so crazy that you said that? Why I really that I was trying to play my fans a song, and I started that song by saying to the artist that I'm on that song with. Oh, I heard you want to do a freaky, a freaky song with Nicki Minaj. That's so crazy that you said that. That is my shit, okay? Since day one, I've been, I still put people on Slumber Party and Freaky Girl to this day. I'm like, no, we, this is, the, this is what we're gonna start off with, okay? First of all, y'all can't even go through the catalog without listening to this <laughs> verse, okay? Thank Hold you. Up. Skip, skip to her this part. Skip to her part. Yeah, skip to, skip to, skip to Nicki. This is what we do on every week when I saw him. Give me all the pretty words. Because my pussy game comes. Oh, when he hit it, he like said, words. he said, and he's pulling with that. that. What? Like he's strumming his good time. That's me, I am a Nas. I am a Keep a couple of pretty bras, cuz what? Pinky. Make a nigga. Bitch, I'm with it. 